our recipe today is going to be very easy. I'm going to start with uh, our dry mix. So let's start with approximately for scones, two cups. I'm going to make savory scones today. So it will be approximately two cups of uh, all-purpose flour here. For the salt, the saltiness, I'm going to take half, half of a teaspoon. Next, the leavener is the baking powder. One teaspoon of baking powder. One teaspoon. I'm going to take brown sugar. We're going to take two. This goes a little bit sweet and savory, so two tablespoons. We are going to skip the egg in this scone recipe. No egg, but we are going to add one other secret ingredient. This is a ground flaxseed, half of a tablespoon. All right, so give that a stir. We need to add two more secret ingredients here. A quarter teaspoon of black salt. And that gives that egginess. This is cracked black pepper. Let's just give this guy a stir here. Two more ingredients, you're going to measure out half of a cup of milk, coconut milk. And you're going to measure out a quarter cup, a quarter cup of coconut oil. And this is rehydrated coconut oil, quarter cup. Last is the toppings, we have spring onions and rosemary. And give that a stir. Now being mindful not to stir too violently like I just did and get it all over the bowl. Nice and light. Notice I'm doing the same motion here. So I'm not really going back and forth. I'm using the same motion. So that should be good enough. At this stage we do need to get our hands dirty. So slightly cuff it like this. Okay, we got it in a nice little ball. And roll it. And that's kind of what you have to do like this. Just taking the base of your hand and slowly counterclockwise like this. Okay, we have a ball. We're pretty much there. Now this you need to rest. Rest this in the fridge for at least half an hour. And because we cheated a little bit, we didn't add any eggs or any milk, we need to let this rest. So rest this in the fridge, 30 minutes. All right, it's been 30 minutes. We're taking it out of the fridge, and this is what we're gonna do. Just lightly take it. You see it's relaxed. The dough's nice and relaxed now. And slap it on the pan. Put a nice pan here. Put it down. Try not to fuss with it so much. So just patting it down a little bit. Okay, so this is what you are looking for, the diameter. You need to take your cutter here. It'll be easier for you guys to see. Take your cutter here, there you go. Just cut it into, usually it's like six. Yeah, six nice scones. Okay, that's that. Take that, like this. Here we go. All right, now. And just lightly oil them. Oil helps give you shine. Again, these product doesn't have a lot of uh, oil in it. So when you put it oil on the top there, it really gives it that nice glaze, seals in the crust, and it helps you, gives you a delicious, Delicious scone. So usually they use butter, but coconut oil goes a long way here. And I'm using a cooking style, a cooking style refined coconut oil that doesn't have any taste to it. So it's very mild taste. It gives you a lovely gloss. There you go. All right, toss these guys in the oven for about 20 minutes at 400 degrees. Hot and fresh, these scones are ready to go. Again, get the recipe at theveganfoodscientist.com, my website, the link is below. Have a good day. And